I don't even really know what to say, dog. I'm going to be honest with you. Uh, all that stuff I normally say, King of the Dot Grand Prix, uh, final, like one of the final rounds to go towards the final four, semifinals, uh, quarterfinals, quarterfinals. Uh, I've seen some of the battles today. Um, I didn't catch every single one, to be honest with you. Uh, I did see Snake Eyes 30, um, my man Dot Everything. Dot Everything, yeah, that was a um, pretty good battle I seen. Then I seen the um, So Severe versus Saint. So Severe versus Saint. I tell you what, Saint is one of them ones. Saint, Saint is really nice. He was getting busy in that one. So Severe did his thing, and I respect the fact that So Severe is very humble about his beginning, about his upbringing. I've watched So Severe battle against a bunch of people and he really earned his stripes and earned his way up. You know, even through the tournament when a lot of people was like he was robbing niggas, you know what I'm saying? He was doing that, you know, no mask, bare face. And um, he got through a bunch of those rounds, you know, he, he did his thing. And even in this battle against Saint, Saint was just the better guy today. Like he really showed the difference in levels, like he had a crazy pop smoke line. He had, he was wild. I ain't gonna lie. Saint made a name for himself and made a mark for himself. Saint been nice though for a minute. Like this ain't even nothing. I'm not even surprised, B. I'm not surprised, B, that Saint got like that because this is what Saint do. You know what I'm saying? Saint, Saint gets busy with the bar. Salute to Saint, uh, that whole West Side. Uh, you know, I know what y'all here for. Y'all wanna hear uh, about Sire the Family Man Hayes Boy, Sire the Family Hayes Man Boy versus Disaster. Um, I'll just give my thoughts on the battle. Uh, I felt like Diz did better in this battle than in some of the other battles in the tournament, like definitely versus Frag. I felt like Diz lost two rounds ago, but he's still here. Um, he battled against um, Sire Boy, well, Hayes the Family Man, and I felt like Diz got the first. I do feel like Diz got the first. Uh, second round, I feel like Hayes got. Third round, to me, is where it gets a little choppy at because even in Diz's first round, he had a clean first. Hayes' first round, he had like a couple of stumbles, like a little, small little smidgy smidgy. It was nothing too crazy, but I think it was like he was like really, he had a lot of energy going because Diz, I'm not going to lie, Diz was wilding in his first. The, towards the end of his first, he had that pop smoke line. Uh, you know, you, the, the pop smoke, I, you'll get your pop smoke by the way you address me online and shit. I thought that was fire. Um, you know, so this is not the hate on Diz blog. That's not what this is about. Um, overall, I kinda, when I, the way I saw it, I edged it to Hayes the Fireman. Hayes the family man. His brothers Burns the Fireman. These niggas is all some man. But, uh, I felt like Hayes got it 2-1 edge. He won the fan vote. And then, you know, when it comes to the judges, nobody's paid. <laughs> Diz got paid two weeks ago. If you got to go to the fan vote, I mean, to the judges, Diz is not losing with the judges. That shit is not going to happen. Like, this, the writing is on the wall. Diz has won this tournament already. We're actually, you're just going through the motions, but Diz has already won this. Like, I don't know if you guys understand that. He won this tournament already. Like, there's nothing else to it. He gonna battle again, he gonna win. He gonna get to the last round, he gonna win that too. He's not gonna lose. And he won the first two rounds, whether people gave it to him, they didn't give him to him, whatever the case may be, without really even super, super writing for his opponent. When it came to Hayes the family man, respectfully, uh, his material was kind of catered towards him. You know, Diz be having all of them, he be having them parts of his rounds where he be like rambling and shit, you know what I'm saying? Britney Spears, 50 years, shifting gears, get me here. He just be rambling about some shit. But in this battle, I felt like a lot more of his material was catered towards him. But uh, in Cali, Hayes didn't really get that reaction. He, but he said it when he was recapping his joint. He said, you know, he wasn't expecting to get no reaction and he really didn't. You know, the crowd building be biased. And I don't even want to really be like the judges was biased because the battle overall is really debatable. Cause like I said, I feel like Diz got the first because Diz's first round was cleaner. He had some bigger moments and he had no stumbles, no slips, no blips. Hayes had a fire material, but then he had like some 
I don't know what it was. I think he was either overexcited or trying to get to some of his material. And even the pockets of material that he had that was really fire, that would have probably hit in other buildings, it, it, wasn't, it, just, it just wasn't hitting like that. But if he would have won with the judges, I wouldn't have been surprised. No, I would have been surprised because, like I said, Diz has already won this tournament. Um, I'm going to be honest with you. I'm probably gonna um, I'm probably gonna switch lanes on this joint. It's not really my speed. I, when I'm seeing MCs win battles that I personally didn't know, I mean personally didn't think they won, I don't know if I'm gonna really keep up with it. I might, but I might not. Like I ain't gonna lie. If, if I don't recap any more of them joints, you know, it, it just is what it is. Because I, I hate seeing battles where I feel like somebody won and then the other person is getting the win. And I know what it means. No disrespect to this. This is respectfully. Like I said, I feel like he did better in this joint. His first round versus Hayes was better than all his rounds in any of the other battles in this tournament. That says a lot right there. His first round, he was. I was like, where's when did he? When was he? Where's he been? So he does get that respect and that admiration. But I know why they're keeping him in this because if the battle's close, it's like baseball. The tie goes to the runner. If the shit is close, they're going to give it to him because his name being in the tournament keeps people watching the stream, keeps the algorithms moving, keeps people talking about it, and things like that, etc., etc., etc. But uh, I, I, this is like the second or third battle where I didn't feel like he won. I didn't feel like he beat the Swords either, and I didn't feel like he beat Frack, and now I feel like he... So I'm like, am I the one that's missing something? Like, am I the one that's missing something while watching these? Like, what am I missing where I'm feeling like the other MC is getting the battle, but the the same person keeps advancing, advancing, advancing. Uh, out of this, uh, there was a couple bright spots in this tournament. Clone was a bright spot. Uh, to come out of nowhere and have the couple battles that he had and do his thing, that was a bright spot. Uh, Times is a bright spot to see somebody, you know, that was kind of, you know, pretty much unknown do his thing. Lou Cypher was a definite bright spot. Even though he wasn't in it, he was, you know, he had a battle in there. That was a bright spot. Uh, so severe to see him come from nowhere and be able to, uh, you know, catch crowds and have people fall in love with what he do. I definitely would look forward to seeing him again. But overall, I mean, uh, Disaster won a close battle. I'm just going to say it like that. You know what I'm saying? I'm going to say Disaster won a close battle. It was a debatable battle overall. So I'm not as mad per se. I'm really not mad because Sire Boy did haze the Sire Man. Haze the Sire Man family guy did his thing. But you gotta, I will say this, you gotta be clean all three. When you're already battling behind the eight ball, and when I say the eight ball, all this battle's been in LA, all of them are gonna be in LA. You gotta go there, you gotta battle that crowd, and you gotta battle the judges. When you're doing all of that, you gotta have the most clean, pristine performance that you could possibly have, because you're already going in to combat behind the eight ball because it's like, that's what, that's what it is. You automatically are going in behind the eight ball. So when you have any slips, any blips, any stumble, any of that shit, you automatically going to lose. I'm going to be honest with you. I don't know who all is left in the bracket. I think uh, Sane is still in there. Disaster is still in there. Uh, I think Marv won. And I don't know who else. I'm going to be honest with you. But I'm going to kind of switch lanes on it. I might, I might peep it if I ain't got nothing going on. But... I, I don't know, man. I'm being honest, man. I'm just keeping 100, man. I don't know what the fuck is going on with this shit. And um, I'm not going to sit here and act like I do. You know what I'm saying? Like, I got a lot of love for what King of the Dot does. But in some of these battles, I just don't know how the people are being picked. What is the criteria? I don't know what the criteria is. But uh, Diz won a close battle. I think that's the only way I can look at it. Sire Boy uh, got some of his name back, got his stock back up. And I'd love to see him back in the ring, get him some more names, get him some more opponents, and hopefully continue to um, to do his thing. You know what I'm saying? But overall, Diz won this tournament the moment he signed up. Uh, he probably already got his first half of the 50 grand. And after he ties his next battle, they give him the other half. Uh, I don't feel no other way about it until I see. Once they said it's got to go to the judges, and when the judges started saying it's a split decision, I already knew. Because mind you, this man, he is the family man one the fan vote and then out of the four judges he only had one judge pick him win the other three went with this didn't even be a split this it wasn't even two two to go to the fan vote 
So three out of the four people picked Hayes the Family Man to lose. How, what battle was they watching? I don't know what battle they was watching. <laughs> I, but like I said, this is probably why I talk about battle rap on this channel. Like me, my man Showtime SP. And we don't judge these things because I quite obviously what we see or what we may feel is not what they're seeing. You know what I'm saying? My Apple Watch keeps buzzing. Fuck this. Um, anyway, so you already know what it's doing, what it does. So you ain't got to ask what it was. Salute to all the MCs in the tournament uh, that are doing their thing. You know what I'm saying? Uh, I got no answers for you. I, I really do not have any answers for you. I'm glad today's over with so I can continue to watch NBA Free Agency and uh, play my uh, NBA 2K. 21 on PS5, you know what I'm saying? That's actually a pretty dope game. It's um, it's different. I got my my player going, you know, and things like that. So you know, if you want to add me on PlayStation Network, it's a uh, Vada underscore Fly V A D A underscore F L Y. Add me on PlayStation Network. We can play games. See, this is what you know. I, this is the things I be thinking of when I see shit like tournaments where it don't go right. I start thinking about sharing my PSN. You know, add me on PlayStation Network. We might be able to run something, man. But um. Other than that, man, salute to the subscribers, that notification gang. Hayes, I just, I don't know. I don't know. I'm gone.